In this video, I'm gonna give you a couple ways to stretch your upper trapezius muscle. So if you kind of grab right here, a lot of people talk about having knots and a lot of tension in here. That's your upper trapezius muscle. And there's a number of ways that you can address that or seek treatment for it. Chiropractic, soft tissue work like Graston, dry needling is really effective, which we do here in the office. But if you're trying to address it at home first and just to get some relief, let's talk about those stretches. So the first thing I want you to do if we're gonna try and stretch this right one is to just take this right hand, put it behind your low back, and then I want you to look to the left and down, and that'll put that muscle to tension. So you'll feel it kind of in your shoulder, in your neck, in your upper back there, and then take this left hand and just add a little resistance. And that'll kind of force it into lengthening out a little bit what you can do to make that more effective is you can do what's called PNF or PIR stretching, where you actually activate the upper trapezius um, and kind of resist against yourself. So let's talk about that. In order to do that, we're gonna be in the same position here. I'm gonna look down to the left and then hand here. And I want to act like I'm turning my head to the right and sort of extending my head and bringing it up, but this left hand's gonna keep me from doing that. So down into this position, then I'm gonna do that action while I'm resisting against myself for five count. One, two, three, four, five. Then relax. You'll notice I get a little bit more length out of it. And then you can repeat that for three or four times. And what will happen is you'll see your upper trap kind of lengthen out a little bit. Another thing you can do if you're at the gym and you have this available is to use a kettlebell or even a dumbbell, somewhere maybe 15 to 30 pounds, and then let that just hang while you're gripping onto it. It'll pull your shoulder down and then you can go into that same position and it'll just give you a greater stretch. There's a spot in your upper trap um, in acupuncture, it's called GB21, but it's just the most common trigger point in everyone. So a lot of people have upper trapezius issues like this. They'll call it neck pain, upper back pain, or shoulder pain. And there's a lot of things you can do for that. So take a look at some of our blog content or our other videos, um, and you'll be able to read a little bit more about it. 